Taking a deeper dive this morning as the Thanksgiving holiday could see the busiest travel numbers ever on record. Yeah, it's going to be busy. So the Transportation Department says it's coordinating with federal agencies and airlines to try to ensure the holiday season goes smooth despite the uptick in travelers. So Drew is on it, breaking yeah. down the advice that they have. Well, a strike doesn't help for sure, but holiday travel projections ahead of Thanksgiving sky high. AAA says 80 million travelers expected over the Thanksgiving holiday with winter weather across the country threatening flights and making for difficult driving conditions and the head of the FAA saying just the other day expect flight delays amid a staffing shortage for them. Not what you want to hear as far as air travel TSA expecting record numbers. The agency projects on Tuesday 2.8 million passengers will be screened 2.9 million on Wednesday and then the Sunday after Thanksgiving they expect to see more than 3 million passengers. These will likely be some of the busiest travel days in U.S. history. Just be patient and recognize people are trying to do their jobs and getting irritated at them doesn't make a bit of, bit of help. And of course, winter weather is threatening to wreak havoc on holiday plans. Severe storms striking the Pacific Northwest while the East Coast races for potential blizzards. And then, of course, a shot of snow here in the Rockies. Kylie's talking about maybe up to three feet in the mountains. So if you're driving up that way, it's going to be difficult. Of course, Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg just heard from. He says because of recent reforms, travelers have more protections than ever before, pointing to the department's new rules demanding automatic refunds for change or canceled flights and new compensation for delays and canceled flights as well. Because Kirk and Andrea, we don't want to happen Last Christmas, where it was a mess. One airline had a meltdown. DIA had bags all over the place for days, maybe even weeks. So, of course, the new rules with the TSA, with the I, I should say, with Pete Buttigieg and the Transportation Department, should help travelers with that. Yeah, we'll see if it makes a difference. Yeah. Thanks, Drew. Mm -hmm.